Hi, welcome to Not Stop Chess Channel. Today we are going to see a game between Robinovich and Gregory Levenfish. This game was played in 1927. Levenfish was born in Poland but played for Russia. He passed on his chess knowledge to many young Soviet chess players. In this game, Levenfish is black and Robinovich is playing white. This is a very short game where white gets punished for his opening mistakes. Robinovich starts with e4 and Levenfish responds with Alekin defense. Let's look at the moves. e4 knight f6. In opening one of the very important point is a pawn should not be moved twice unless it is very needed. So this is the first mistake that white makes. So knight is forced since it's being attacked it's moving then white plays knight. This is a good move since you have to develop the king side. Black tries to attack the e pawn and now again white makes another mistake of developing the bishop in the wrong square because knight black knight can move to f4 and attack the g2 square where it can give a check or exchange the bishop the ideal square would have been bishop c4 but here white plays bishop e2 now after black plays knight f4 white has many choice here he could have castled which actually would have helped him uh, to at least not get mated quickly but instead he makes the bishop to f1 and another violation to the opening you should never move the same piece twice unless it is needed in the opening black captures the e pawn and then the knight captures the e pawn eleven fish sees there are two blunders that has been made and trying to make use of it so he brings the queen immediately to the center usually the queen should not be moved until the black develops his king side castles but here because of the two opening mistakes black seizes the opportunity and comes to the center since the knight is attacked the knight goes back to knight f3 11 fish gives a check now the bishop is played the third time within a span of eight moves so these are mistakes as a youngster which you should try to avoid now 11 fish gives a check the king moves to f1 now black plays bishop h3 now white doesn't have much choice here um, to defend the position he could have played the knight to g5 but um, white instead tried to attack the queen with the passive d3 now let me pause here for you to think what would have eleven fish played here it's, uh, he played a very brilliant move knight h4 now when he played knight h4 there's two options for white one he can come to e1 or king g1 now either of that gets mated let's assume he comes to king e1 the knight captures the knight in f3 and checkmate this bishop cannot move because there is a discovered check by the queen so let's go back and see what happens if the king moves to g1 again 
the queen comes to g4 check and mate there is no defense for the king to go back to f1 or defended with any piece so hope you all like this uh, brilliant game that was played by learnfish if you like the video please share it with your friends looking forward to make more such videos from non-stop chess thank you